It's your girl Tay XOXO and I'm back with another freaking video. Yeah, so y'all, I didn't do an intro, so I am introing now and I'm in Colorado. So, but I'm about to leave. So I'm about to take y'all on the journey with me and y'all are about to see everything that went happening and went on during my trip, okay? So let's get into the video that's not roasting Jack Frost nipping at your nose so I'm offering a sample phrase okay it's taking me to the airport because she's five minutes away and it took me an hour and Nine minutes to get here. Why? I don't know. I I took the toll and everything. Oh, so welcome home. It was far. I forgot. I thought Umbo was down the street. It's not. It's not. Yeah, it was a drive. So My legs. Quick hop, skip, jump. And through the mud and the bayou the and the rain and there was yeah. two cops. One cop in front of me. One cop behind oh. me. I was like, oh, oh not can we? Me too. Can we just move around? Okay, y'all, so I'm at the airport and um, I went through clear. This was like my first time doing that, but it was worth it. It was free and I got to stick the line and I'm hungry. So that's a good thing because I just want to eat and go on about my day. Okay, like for real. Like standing in line at the airport gives me so much anxiety. So it was worth it and I'm glad I got it and I'm gonna keep it until I can get pre-check. So let's go to Colorado. so tired and I'm meeting two other people because we got an Uber together so I'm meeting new friends new co-workers so woo but I have to get my bag first so my lashes look so crazy oh my goodness Okay, I'll see y'all in a little bit. So I'm here at my hotel, and when I say it, it's so freaking stinking pretty here, y'all. Like, oh, look at that light. But my roommate isn't here yet, so but that's been touched. But apparently my roommate is not here yet. But I'm going to show y'all outside real quick because it's so pretty. So this doesn't give it any justice, you guys, because when we came in, it was so pretty, and I didn't record because... I was just so like in awe with all the lights. So yeah, I'm about to go get some food cause I'm like super hungry and they close at 12. So I'll take a shower too, because I need to take a shower. And yeah, I'm about to take a shower and do that to go get me some food and get ready for tomorrow. Guys, look at this. Y'all, I'm trying to get y'all video, but I am hungry, okay? So cute. So adorable. Oh, look. I'm in love.
sun, you guys. Oh my goodness, day one. Uh -huh. Look, there's no mountains over here, but that's fine. It's flat land, but it looks so pretty. The snow is out. I think it snowed a couple of days ago, so there's a little snow on the ground, but yeah. <laughs> Day one of competition. I'm so excited. I'm about to go downstairs and get me some Starbucks. I might get Starbucks, but we'll see once I get downstairs. But yeah, we're going. Woo! Big check, business cash. A little something slight. I didn't want to do too much because I wanted to be comfortable. I got me some tea, y'all, because my nose is running. But I want to show y'all something that's happening outside of my hotel. Like, look how cool this is. Y'all, they have ice skating and sledding. You can see the sledding, like, right there. And the ice skating's right there. And they have, like, the little... I'm trying to show y'all the window. You can't see the window. They have ice skating, these little tubes. And then they have the sledding over there. So pretty, love it. But yeah, y'all, so day one was great. Um, I forgot how much I love coming to cheer competitions. Like, and I'm working, you know, so it's just fabulous and I love it. But I'm about to go lay down because my ankles are swollen. Like, y'all can see my ankles. They're swollen. I don't know why they're swollen, y'all, because I've been sitting down all day. So, I don't really know. I don't know if it's the shoes. I don't know if it's this weather change. Everything out here in Colorado is healthy, so I don't really know why, you know, my ankles will be swollen. But, I don't know. I'm going back to my room because I'm sleepy. So, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Y'all, I was gonna go and um, walk around the hotel, but I'm so tired. Like, I have my feet kicked up. Like, I'm about to go to bed. So, I will see y'all in day two of me being in Colorado. I'm gonna walk around tomorrow after the competition is over and show y'all the hotel outside and everything because it's so pretty. So. I will show y'all everything. I'm about to sit here and watch Christmas movies. Um, yeah. This is a great getaway, you guys. I needed this. Like, I know I'm here for work, but I'm just enjoying, like, the hotel and being able to relax. It's beautiful. So, I will see y'all tomorrow, okay? Day two, we are on the way. I have a dress on, but it's day two. And I'm headed down, trying not to be late. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. Yeah, I don't know what's going on, but my nose is hurting so bad. It feels like it's about to like start bleeding because of this weather out here. Like so much pressure. <gasps> like doing that. Oh my goodness, that hurts. Oh my goodness. Y'all had to get some air and some sun because we're in the dark. <laughs> and I just need a little sun. But y'all, it feels good out here. It's cold, but it's like okay. You can only I can only last in this for like a uh, ten more seconds. Cause I can see my breath. Yeah, this was cute for the five seconds that I was out here, but it's really pretty out here, y'all. And the air is so crispy. So, going back in. <laughs> came down, y'all, I look crazy. I came down to the um, gift shop so I could see if they have anything that I want. I think I might get me a... <laughs> I don't know because there's so much stuff in here, but I want something that says Colorado on it. I don't want something random.
We here. It's a video. <laughs> Y'all, we're about to go outside. We're about to freeze our ass. Off. Louisiana and Texas. Y'all know we, we're not going to be out that long. Yeah. We're going to we're show buying them. hats. She got hers. Mine in my pocket. Okay, baby. <laughs> we, don't, we don't do We're going to freeze. Yeah, we're going to freeze. But that's okay. Because we're having a good time. Right. We'll post videos of us busting our ass. Yes, period. Y'all, it's so cold. Right when we stepped right down. It's freezing. Ah, here we go. Into the thick of it. Into the th oh my goodness. Y'all look. Oh, it's, not it's not bad. This is so cute. So is it done? Oh man. Oh, Was it even ice? Wow. And we missed it. It's closed. See, when you work hard, you miss all the fun. Look at all the pretty lights, though. Y'all, we can't even get over there to the lights, but they're so pretty. Y'all, they really closed everything down. Oh, it's like a little, like see? A little ski lift, but I ain't sitting on that. Right, it's probably cold. <laughs> Freezing ski lift. Y'all look at all the stuff that they have. This is so cool. going to the blue balls. blue balls blue balls it's calling our name <laughs> oh, it's like a heater right here yeah it was the heat on one side and then the other side heat on one side it was cold look at this look at my face it's literally the girls from the south we don't do this we come outside for the scenery and we take our asses back in. Exactly. <laughs> but that's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh, it's you so have pretty. to take a picture. snow down here but it's hard now because it snowed like on thursday but like look how cool that you is guys, you can have a snow we're about to have a snowball fight you guys oh you know what catch Ooh. don't get me <laughs> Such a pretty tree. Yeah, I'm putting my tree up when I get home. I wasn't gonna do it this year. I just decorated my apartment. But now, we're putting the tree up. We are now in the spirit because of Colorado. Childish. <laughs> <laughs> Only adults. 
No, ch no children. Childish. It's us. <laughs> Liquor right, here. right. If you win, you get a little shooter to go. <laughs> no. Do we have to have our key? No, it's closed. Oh, it's closed. Indoor pool. Oh, so look, look at the you guys. Slide. There's a water slide yep. all so in the cool. corner. Y'all, we missed everything. Sorry, vlog, for not having the stuff, but it's okay. So, you can so you can look up place. Gaylord. Colorado and bring your family. Yeah, we're, 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 right, what's that? Um, I don't know. That's what I want to look first. <laughs> okay, you just pull that door open so that's Hold on, let me, let me close it first. Oh, wait, maybe I should do this. Hold on. Close it. Oh, oh yeah, to see. Okay. okay, it opens. We are on an adventure. Oh, it goes outside. Oh wow. Now y'all, if my little time, if my butt would have got cold right there at the corner, I'd be like, yeah, I'm not doing this no more. It's like you could, you, but maybe the water is warm on the slide, you know? Yeah, because all this little kids are being. Oh, see. <laughs> see. <laughs> look, okay. I saw grown-ups. Y'all, look. It's an indoor pool. I didn't even know. Yeah, I wanted to be surprised. I would have bought my entire bathing suit. But... This is so nice. This is a great resort. Coming out the, the Gaylord, Gaylord. Gaylord Rockies. When you get here, you come to the Lobby Bar, Pinions, best bar in town. We got the Dream Team here. We got Mo, we got Melissa, aye, aye. and we got Josh and Christy tomorrow. You come here, you see us, best time of your life, guaranteed. Are you here all year? I'm here all year, year round, last four years. 2022 for 2023. Correct. Be here 2023, be here all year 2023. Tell my people happy holidays, Merry Christmas, happy, holidays, happy Hanukkah. Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, Merry Kwanzaa. What's that? What else we got? <laughs> And tell them Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy Chinese New Year. That already passed. Yes. Happy American New Year. There's probably some Jewish New Year I don't know about. Happy New Year there too. And say, I love all my Taybays. I love all my Taybays. Every single one. <laughs> okay, I'm getting back in. I, I must go. <laughs> okay, y'all. So, I just woke up. It's 3. About to be 3.59. About to be 4 o'clock. So, I just woke up and... My roommate is gone, like, <laughs> so she must have a flight, like, early at 5, like, a lot of people, because they have to get back to work. Oh. Okay, y'all, so I just woke up, okay, like, it's 3.59, which is ironic, because it's about to be 4 o'clock. I might have woke up, woke up at 3.58 or whatever. But y'all, I just woke up and I turned my light on because I looked over and I'm like, are you up? Because I thought I heard something. 
but it had to be like y'all the door closing y'all my roommate is gone my roommate is gone she's gone so um she must have had a flight like early this morning because a lot of people it's monday and a lot of people had to like go back and go to work so y'all i just woke <laughs> up out of the dead sleep dead at night just woke up um to see that my roommate is gone so i'm about to pack my clothes because i have to wake up in a little while to go to the airport and I didn't really pack my clothes. I kind of just threw them in my suitcase. So I kind of want to um, pack everything. But I have a little time. So, y'all, this trip has been amazing. Like, I know I came out here for work. But I want to tell y'all, like, this is really like, oh, I'm going to, on a work trip to Colorado. And... I wanted to bring y'all along with me, which was kind of hard because my days were from 7.30 a.m. to 8 at night. So, it was a it was long days, so I couldn't really, to where I'm working all day. Y'all, crazy thing. <coughs> my phone has never stayed charged. For a whole eight hours. Mind you, I'm sorry. World of Gumball is on. So if you hear it, you hear it. You know, if you watch it, if you have kids, you watch it. But my phone has never ch stayed charged a full day. So this is how you know that I haven't been on my phone a long time. I haven't been able to really record because of what I'm doing. And you guys, it was so like... My anxiety, I don't know if I really told y'all about my anxiety and stuff like that. I'll have to do it like a story time about my anxiety. But y'all, the way that I've been like going and going and going and going, there's no room. There's been no room. Like y'all, this is like a blessing in disguise that I needed um, for real because there's no room for thought. It's all room for, it's it's room for thought, but it's not room for thought about my personal issues. It's all about the sport and it's all about like something that I love and y'all like even when it was, my job, I got done today before a lot of the people that I work with got done and I was just sitting there like enjoying the cheer competition like because I love cheerleading Y'all yeah, love cheer, so I love to watch it. I love to see, like, young athletes, like, perform. So I sat there and watched the young, the um, teams perform and da-da-da-da-da before they were done. But I left at the award ceremony because I need to come home and go to sleep. <laughs> but I didn't go to sleep. I um, walked around with one of my coworkers that I... I enjoyed a lot of my coworkers this weekend, like people that I've never met a day in my life. Um, enjoyed them because I know I'll be working with them again. So I enjoyed them, conversation, getting to know them, you know what I mean? So that happened. I was in the competition and then I came back. I showered, threw all of my clothes in my suitcase, didn't pack the right way i just threw out my stuff made sure everything was ready and i just sipped it up <laughs> but y'all this weekend has been so amazing like when we walked around the hotel i got to see the hotel is this place that i'm staying at beautiful y'all like so beautiful a beautiful resort it's called the gay lord in colorado so if you ever want to get like a resort in colorado this is definitely the place because it's so beautiful it's family oriented um it's kind of like if you know what the wood wood what is it called great wolf lodge great wolf lodge like resort type situation it's like that but it's more like adult oriented so they have more things for adults um the great wolf lodge has like a whole like scene of wizardry 
going on with the kids where they get the wands and stuff. Like here, you can take your kids around. You can have a, they have the spa. I showed y'all that, which we couldn't get into because it was closed. Mind you, I worked until it's sun. It was, it's Sunday being Monday to where we, I worked. So I couldn't really go to the place because they were all closed. But it's very nice, like during the winter, if you want to bring your family here for like a week and enjoy, or like a four day week, like after they get out of school and stuff enjoy it um the christmas lights are so nice like so pretty i literally was saying like oh i want to put up my tree now because i'm so in the christmas spirit <laughs> because it's so pretty like all the christmas music and the lights and stuff like that really got me in the spirit so this is a rant because i'm letting y'all know how it went so everything here was so beautiful um but the thing about colorado is the weather um it's very cold here i'm used to humidity and you know warm weather which is 70 degrees which is kind of still cold but not as cold as it is here so all of my co-workers we all like had like pressure built up like in our nose we were all sneezing our throats were dry y'all know my throat is always dry so that's nothing new but y'all it's literally so dry and the altitude that we're in is different so literally y'all when i i I felt like my nose was stopped up, but it wasn't stopped up. So when I went to go blow it, it was literally like, this is disgusting, but like, like blood clots on, on some stuff. Like, I don't know if this is something that's been wanting to come out or I'm here and now it's like, oh, you have built up pressure, push it out. It's like, I don't know if it's therapy, like sinus therapy, or I just... I'm not used to this weather. So if you ever come out here, y'all, I have three inhalers out here just in case. I have an asthma tech because I've been here before and I knew like my asthma couldn't deal with the weather. So it's been a real tough journey with like my head and a lot of our heads because a lot of us are not from here. The people that are from here, they're like, yeah, my body's used to it y'all like yeah you know it is what it is it happens da, 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 da. so it's been really trying with the head area so um i didn't let i didn't show y'all the food or anything but we got fed like for lunch and dinner and the food was good um it's not Whataburger. A lot of things here are very healthy. So we got healthy options, but we had like chicken breast, steak for dinner tonight. We had chicken, steak, um, halibut, salad, like nice salad, y'all. Like, And then like sweet potato mix with, what did he call it? What did he say? It was um, rutabaga. Y'all, I thought it was potatoes. It wasn't, it was rutabaga. And baby, I ain't never had rutabaga in my life. And it was so thick. So that I don't I don't I didn't really like it. But he said it was it's good fried. So I would have to try it fried before anything. So like our lunches were like really good too. Y'all, the food was good. It was good. They gave us these little hot sauce bottles, these Tabasco bottles. I said I was gonna get them. Oh my god. Look, um, Gumpa, you're 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 loud and acting like child. This children talking, so you know they're over aggressive. So yeah, so all the food was good. Um, you know, you always if you're coming from the south, coming to Colorado, you're like, oh, this it it was it's burp, it's all healthy, y'all. Like so, the food we were given for lunch and dinner was hearty, so it was tasty and it was hearty it wasn't greasy none of that stuff so but it was it was really good like i'm 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 happy that we got fed but y'all like i am like i don't know tonight after dinner i don't know i don't even remember if it was after dinner before dinner but because i'm just so used to like 
greasy foods. Y'all, I was smelling like barbecue. Like, <laughs> when I get home, I want barbecue. That's what I want. I want barbecue or I want seafood, and that's it. Or fried chicken. I don't know if it's because, like, I would have to, and the thing is, if you go back, if, you're, if you've been here for a long time, you know that I've been to Colorado and I vlogged it. It was a random choice to come to Colorado and I enjoyed myself. Um, this was during, it was during COVID and I was okay, but I think like when I was here, I was like, dang, there's, I want to eat. Like I want to eat so bad, like fried foods and like burgers and all that stuff that we have back home, but it's very healthy here. So if you ever come to Colorado, like just be ready. There's, it's, it's a lot of healthy foods. It's a lot of, um, you can find a burger, but it's not as greasy as it is when you're wherever you're from. So, but everything was great here. Like y'all, mind you, my girl, my sister Yolanda from the old vlog when I came to Colorado, she and Armani, Armani doesn't live here anymore. And, but this is her hometown and Yolanda is stationed in, um, another part of California of Colorado so she's back at home right now so I didn't get to see her so I can see her when I go back home I can't wait to see Yolanda I'm so excited because she just came back home from Europe from um the army being based out there so that's another story but y'all will see Yolanda during the Christmas break while I'm vlogging and Armani lives in Texas now so I can't wait to see my girl, but she's not here either. So I wanted to see them, but it's okay because I didn't have time anyway. But y'all, this was like a rant, just telling y'all how Colorado went. Um, I enjoyed my time here and y'all will see me next on the plane. I'm about to take a little nap before I have to go to the airport because I have like maybe two hours before I have to actually leave. So yeah, but y'all, I met so many amazing people here. Y'all know I'm very, I'm very friendly. And my coworkers that I met, I'm in love with. And I can't wait to like enjoy the rest of this season with them and the ones that are that live in Houston. I we all talked about like, oh, we're gonna go out to eat for dinner, we're gonna go do this, we're gonna do that. They have plans. They're, some of them are married with children. Like, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, I can't wait. And I'm about to take my nap, you guys. And I'll see y'all at the airport. I love y'all so much. So, I'll see y'all. Okay, y'all. I'm awake. Um, I woke up a little bit early. Like, I took a 30-minute nap. Like, so, I'm maybe an hour nap. But I'm up now. And, y'all, I just did some with my baby hairs. Like, I've never pulled them down, like, really far and brushed them up but i pulled them down like all the way down here and was like oh no that's not gonna work for me so i got them back regular to where they usually are <laughs> but i just wanted to tell y'all they're like what the what the what i can't i can't have baby hairs that are down here to my forehead okay i can't do it and my baby hairs aren't baby hairs they're edges like i, I don't have baby hairs these are edges these are like short hairs that are in the front they, these aren't baby hairs i'm an adult okay okay i don't i, I do y'all call them baby hairs or edges i just say edges i'm gonna swoop my edges down but that's another story for another day but i'm about to go um this hotel has been great i'm about to head out and go to the hotel i mean to the airport i'm already at the hotel but yeah and i have a question y'all like I'm going to put this on TikTok too, but why do all of the, uh, like every hotel I go to, like I go to hotels a lot. Why do every, like I bring my own soap and stuff. So <clears throat> I only use the soap that they have, like the squeeze soap when I need to wash my hands or if, you know, I'm going really fast and I just need some like lotion for my hands. Why do they all smell the same? Are they made by the same people? Like, that's just a question. 
if y'all know, y'all know. If you've gotten this far into the video, hashtag hotel soap. I want to know your opinion. Like, does anybody else think that? Y'all know I'm real random. And y'all, I forgot my spoolie to comb out my eyelashes. So they're all going, like, whichever way. But, yeah. So if you got this far, hashtag that. Don't cheat. Don't cheat. Don't cheat. Don't cheat. And put an emoji, like the soap emoji, after if you actually, you know, got here. Yeah. So I'm about to go to the, to the um, airport, y'all. The airport is literally right there. I'm about to show y'all. Y'all, look. The airport is literally right over there. Y'all see it? It's right there. It's right it's right there. So I'm like five minutes away from the airport. So, yeah, I'm about to head out. Yeah, I'm so excited to go home. Like, I really like Colorado, but it's time to get back to Houston so I can give me some water back, girl. Okay. Okay. I'm headed out. Outfit for the port. All black Uggs, leggings. Gramlin hoodie. I wear my Gramlin hoodie to the airport, y'all, every time because I like to rip where I came from, y'all. Oh, and I left my itch and show, so let me get that. And y'all, I usually leave like the to go toothpaste and toothbrush or whatever because it's only like 99 cents. But I leave it here because I usually use up all of the toothpaste. Like I squeeze all, I brush my teeth a lot while I'm here. Like while I'm away, because I just want to use up all the toothpaste and use it while I'm here, like morning, night, after I eat. So the toothpaste be gone. So there's no reason of me bringing it back home with me, using it again. I just go to Walmart and get another 99 cent one. But yeah, so this is the fan. I'm about to go home. Oh, Denver, this was cute. I am in love. I'll be, be back. This is my second time being actually being in Denver. So I enjoyed myself. And yeah, until next time. And if I have any Denver like subscribers, let me know. Or if you've ever been to Denver, what part have you been to? Let me know down below in the comments. And y'all, I didn't even say this before, but make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. I have been slacking on letting y'all know that. And follow me on all social media at TayXOXO with two underscores on Instagram and Twitter. And TayXOXO with one underscore on TikTok. I'm going to change that so it can be TayXOXO with two underscores on everything. But yeah, make sure y'all go follow me. And Denver, I'll see you next time. Well, the Gaylord Hotel because I like this place. And I'll definitely be back. once in a while but I, not not very often though it's not as polluted as texas let me tell you that and i'm i live in houston so you know <laughs> yeah, we have well, the oil the the you well know. like today it's really clear you can look at the mountain yes it's so pretty and i got here at night so oh wow and i've been working I just seen. Hello. 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 We ready to go home. Because it's dry out here. It's dry. My the lotion dry. isn't working. My lips dry. My nose dry. Mm -hmm. Everything is dry. My hands. <laughs> I hate it.
Y'all, I am home. I know it's like you can't really see me, but I'm finally home. I'm tired. Um, I had a great weekend and I got to cheer and have practice tomorrow. So, cheer goes on. Cheer is life. If you didn't know, now you know. But y'all, I'm about to take a healthy nap that is well needed. And I'll see y'all in the next video. I love you guys so, 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 so much. All of my tape base. Mm -hmm.